What's up, bitches? Welcome back to the Offline Road to Glory series. And as you can see, we are currently sitting nice and comfortably in 27th place. I don't know how because I've been playing absolute doo doo this week. And I think it might be the team that I'm struggling with. Uh, I haven't really got the players that I really want. Uh, I'm messing around with like trying to fit players in and then ruining other positions. And I'll show you the team now in a sec. Um, but I was going to do a live com on this game. But look at that, <laughs> I messed that up so much, uh, I nearly lost, I was literally scored on the last minute of extra time to take it to penalties, and I don't know how I won in penalties, but I did, but I tell you what, like, the game just felt rigged, I was talking, I was trying to teach how you guys had to defend when doing it, I let it go straight away from kickoff, I was like, oh my god, like, maybe this isn't the best video to do, um, and yeah, like, I, I, I just don't know what happened, um, there was a few instances where I was three in one on one against the keeper and I did the low driven finesse shot and it just blazed it. And I remember one of you guys commenting it saying like that that happens for you as well. That's never happened well, it used to happen for me, but I think they patched it and it's working, but then it did it today and I don't know why. But it was only in that game where I I experienced it. I played nine games today. Nine games too many, <laughs> you could say. Uh, but yeah, as I said, sitting comfortably, 27th place, uh, we're probably going to get overtaken a little bit. I, we don't deserve to be 27th. Um, as I said, I've been playing absolute doo-doo. Um, uh, but let me show you the squad. I was trying to fit Saul in, which you would have seen in the last video. Um, so Saul is now in there. Um, I thought we'd treat ourselves to Griezmann. He doesn't really have the pace that I really want, but I remember playing with him in online games before and thinking he was a really good player. That was his 88 card. Um, I really enjoyed it, and um, yeah, this one's just terrible. Like, eight goals in nine game. <laughs> He's not good. He's not good at all. Rashford, though, is not too bad. Twelve goals in nine. Um, and Pogba, I've, I've used him as Cam before, and I thought he was decent, but in this, he's not really doing it. So, I don't know. We'll persevere with this for a little bit longer, but I might have to change this up again. Um, it's just who can we get with Saul to go there? Let me just quickly have a look at Footman, because... Um, I haven't properly looked at La Liga team this season because if we can get like a Spanish striker and maybe put like David Silva there and then we can maybe put mm, no we can't really put Sane there because he'd have to be right footed. Uh, we could put someone there. <laughs> we could put someone there. I mean, right, let me let me see who's in uh, La Liga team this season. Right, this is the most consistent. Let me quickly check. There's no one in there. Could be in all. Right, there's no one in that one. Right, right, right. Come on, come on, come on. Right. Uh, La Liga. Okay, so we have Ronaldo, not going to be able to afford that. Griezmann again. Nope. Um, so we're looking like for like a Spanish striker. Rodrigo. Four star skills, three star weak foot. That's the problem. I need someone who's kind of left footed. Iago Aspas. He's 190k actually. Is he left footed? I seem to think he is. He's got 90 pace. Guedes is another one we could look at as well. Like, I don't mind playing wingers up there, as long as they got a left foot. Actually, I don't know if Guedes, Guedes will get the can. Ooh, Iago Aspas might be the one. High, high though. Left foot, five foot nine. So he doesn't really... I don't know. I, I'm thinking Iago Aspas. So look at Guedes. Portuguese. Valencia. You won't get the can, would he? No. We could do we could do it, Aspas. Do you know what? As well. YOLO. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna do Aspas. Um That does mean that we'll have to sell Pogba and Rashford. <laughs> yeah, I'm just changing this team up so much. So I was thinking maybe like go in uh so we got Aspas who would go there. So there you go, Aspas there. And then he would need another link. So it's a case of whether we go for a, like an icon. Like how much are icons at the moment? I wonder if we can go for someone like Rui Costa or Deco or someone a bit in there. Um, I, I know you guys can't really see what I'm doing, but I, I'm using Footbin just to, just to see. Uh, I can't. Wait, give me icons in here. Yeah, icons there, okay. Uh, so what's the cheapest icons that we could get? Can't afford Ronaldo. So we got <coughs> Inzaghi, Clivert, 
strategic culture, but he's a right wing. Okay, realistically, Laudrup is probably the one to be. That's not really going to be good enough, though. He's 240k. Rui Costa could also. Glenn, who are you going to get from the Prem? Wow, Thierry Henry's 87 is at 240k. Ooh. His passing's a bit crap, though. Uh, you guys have just been like, what the heck are you doing? What are you doing, Arkle? You're just wasting our time. Oh, no, no, I am. I know, I'm sorry. Okay. Um, I was looking at... Oh, I don't know. I've used beer can before as well. Right. Right, let me just give you an idea, okay? So we could either go for someone like Silver. Uh, where is he even there? Uh, I don't know which one I'll be able to afford, um, but it shouldn't matter too much. So go for Silver there, um, and then we would need a either a Spanish striker from the Prem, a French striker from the Prem, or a Man City or Watford striker. So we could go for like Aguero. I don't know how much he costs right now, but I can't imagine it'd be stupidly expensive. It's like that. That might be alright. He's 87 pace, not as pacey as I'd like. Um, this is a problem for f future Michael, anyway. Um, something that we can look into. We only got like 30k. After I saw the other guys, though, um, we'll look into it. But we got this one pack to open, guys, and then that'll be the end of the video. Now, we could get Lozano in this, which would be sick. And it is blue. Four star, four star. It's got eight and then pace. This acceleration is a bit meh, but we could just put a hundred one in. Do you know what? It's not a bad card. How tall is he? Five seven. He could be quite pacey. I'm pretty sure he's tradable as well, right? Oh, Michael Weed. <laughs> yeah, I think he's tradable. Um. Okay, it's not it's not the worst. Like Lozano would have been obviously the best, but I was looking at that uh, Farfan as well, and that Farfan looks sick. Um, what are we going? Like Valeri might have been okay as well. I'm just having a look if there's anyone who could have been better. How is Cockering a ninety ninety three pace? Jesus Christ. The Martinez looks alright as well. Uh, he's, he's not he's not the worst one. He's, I don't know if he's I don't think he's the best one either. Lazano would have been the best. He's 215k. This guy's going for 60. Everyone else is going for 60 as well. Yeah, there's only one real winner out of those. Larry's extinct apparently. Um but yeah, like so yeah guys pretty much going to be the end of the video um it's just going to be working out how to link in saul really um it's pretty difficult i think something like this could be all right maybe we could have like inform jesus i haven't tried that card like i've tried the 83. have i tried the 83? jesus could be an interesting one how much is jesus at the moment uh Is. This path to glory could actually be a really good shape for an investment. That's 210k, or 120 for his normal, his uh, inform. Right, I remember that one, that cup was like 600k. 120k for Jesus. So we we could get Aspas, who's like 100 and something as well. Like, we sell Griezmann's for like 300k, Pogba's like 100k. So that's 400k. And who was the cam? Who the hell was cam? No, it was Pogba cam. Rashford, Rashford's 60k. That's like 460k plus 30. We could do this then. We could do this. I th I think I want to try this Aspas. I think I think he'd be a good card. Uh, what would you chuck on him? 
hawk. I think a hawk would be the best on him, right? Yeah. Um. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna sort this out off cam. I'm not gonna waste any more of your time. You can kind of see like my brain ticking of like how I'm gonna rate this team around. It's either gonna be, I'm definitely gonna go for Aspas. I think he's a good shout. But then I need one link to him at cam. Who also needs to get a link to Matic. It's either going to be an icon or someone like David Silva or like Cathola or like Mata or Herrera. Someone like that. Someone like Spanish Prem or a icon. Just thinking. I don't know. <laughs> Sorry for wasting you guys' time. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, if you're enjoying the videos and you're enjoying the series, please drop a like on the video. Uh, you may have just missed this now, but I will be doing my Pro Clubs series on Twitch every Thursday, 4 p.m. till about 6 p.m. So turn on the light now when the video comes out. So if you do want to get involved, you have to follow before the stream. Otherwise, you have the possibility of not being involved. But I'll be recording the two to three hours that we do play. And I'll be uploading it to YouTube. It'll be a road to Division 1. But I'm leaving it all to you guys. I'm playing at left back. I'm totally staying out of the way. Uh, but hopefully you guys will be interested in that. Um, but yeah, other than that, hope you pat someone awesome. Hope you pat Lozano. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.